Chris Wood here, August 30th, 2022. Congratulations, William Aldridge of 149 Center Street North. Blair Hardy, allegedly in Quinney Detention Center on false drug charges. Congratulations to Tyler Lake, Javen Alstein, Destiny Larrabee, Crystal Larrabee, the little bastard, the gray-haired guy with glasses named Mike, he's a homeless guy, he lives in a trailer or a tent. With the rest, congratulations to Ray Ray, Sam, Hope Mills, Ali Cooper, Bucktooth Bob. Congratulations to Tyler Lake, Javen Holstein, and the bastard that drives around in the BMX bike that hangs with Tyler, the fat guy with the scruffy beard and uh, the mess scabs. Congratulations to Bert Hustler, Maggie Falls, OPP, Spencer Mills, 14716, Staff Sergeants, Ex Chief. Stacy, mental health worker, Shannon Cork, Robert Lucas, Robert Keane, Shelly Hafner, or Hafner, Dr. Tatiana B, Dr. Joy Hadley, Dr. McGregor, Dr. Waldron, Dr. Barton, Dr. Andambola, Triage Nurse Tanya, Triage Nurse Terry, Triage Nurse David, and Paladin Security, Dr. Waldron, Dr. Barton, Dr. Pritchard, Dr. McGregor, and the triage nurses, Joy Hadley and Tatiana, Stacy's girlfriend, and Paladin. You are all human traffickers. You are all guilty of aiding William Aldridge, Blair Hardy, and OPP in homicides. You are guilty of ending bloodlines. You are guilty of injuring. You are guilty of torturing. You are guilty of aiding in kidnapping and sex assaults. You are guilty of deforming OPP or putting prisoner tracking onto their victims, their human trafficking victims that they stalk for framing as other, as other inmates. This to me is revenge retaliation on me for speaking of police crimes since 2019. I've been had my skull split. I've had my seriously brain injured, medical treatment refusals, lies, cover-ups, time bomb, doctors trying to have me falsely arrested for what, and them arrested for crimes that they are guilty of to deflect. Same with OPP, which worked in their favor to give me a record which I never previously had, and to also get everything else you needed for this framing, for this identity theft, the prints, my pictures, my signatures, you got my blood, my piss, everything done into the biometric to do this. I am being deformed and changed, and how it's being done is through what is called remote neural monitoring. It is military and police tech that has been in use by them since the 60s and not many people are aware of it. What it does, it's a microchip implant that basically destroys a person's nervous system so OPP and the military and that can basically neutralize and fuck their fuck victims. All Pontius Pilot. And that's exactly what I have on me. They see me doing this. They hear me doing it. I am illegal surveillance for OPP. They are guilty of the human trafficking, the human sex trade, slavery trafficking. These are the people that buy and sell your children. They are drug traffickers. I am in the process of identity theft so I can be framed as William Aldridge of 149 Center Street North. OPP boss, co-offender, sex offender, and wanted inmate that they are harboring. He is using this remote neuro monitoring on me, along with everybody else. While they are high on OPP drugs, delivered from Spencer Mills and Robert Kane to them, along with their money, to broadcast through me, to use this on me, to pass it around while they are high to a bunch of different people in hopes to mentally fuck me up, 
in hopes to take me off of my own consciousness, in hopes that I get tired of this and possibly mentally break and do something to myself or someone else, and I am not going to have that. I'm not going to let that happen. I am not going to give you the unjustifiable, justifiable means that you need to, co to to finish this fucking bullshit on me, Spencer Mills and OPP, the revenge retaliation. You are guilty of having Wildridge last known his name and Blair Hardy of stalking my mother and using iron and on her causing tumors and cancer causing her death with intent back in December of 2020 just like everything against me is premeditated with intent revenge retaliation for me speaking of your fucking crimes you fuck children you buy sell people you frame you false arrest, you lie, you buy time, you sodomize, you have your victims medically blacklisted. You use your badges, your credentials as a means to get out of it, to, to, to be above suspicion of the crimes that you are committing, and that's why you're so successful doing it, especially right here in Napanee. You have the doctors that I've named, you have the justice of the peace to make accusations on your victims to get away with this. As a result, I am the end of my bloodline, and I am the victim of identity theft. I'm the victim of attempted murder. I'm the victim of brain injuring, skull splitting, and right now doing this, I am being seriously numbed down. I feel absolutely nothing in the right side of my head, in my face. It's taken three years, but this is pretty much done, so... Congratulations, Waldridge. Congratulations, Blair Hardy, and the rest of you fucks. You are broadcasting through me. You're injuring my fucking skull. You are injuring my brain. You have doctors here to refuse treatments. You have doctors here at Paladin Security to illegally kick people out to help buy time. You cast your lies, senior file, senior file. That's what I get when I go to different hospitals, thanks to Tatiana. She's the one that assures her girlfriend Stacy's homicides. And their boss is William Wildridge's. He's untouchable. He is unarrestable. I've been trying for three years. They will go to the extent of surrounding with their hands on their guns to prevent anything on him. Anything on them and anything on the doctors here. And I have video to prove it. I've been trying for three years. So. I am 50 years old and I am the victim of Ontario Provincial Police Lennox and Hannington. I am the victim of sex slavery trafficking through the police. Identity theft, kidnapping, sex assaults, attempted murder, and my identity theft. Along with having Wildridge's prisoner tracking on me. Along with having remote neural monitoring on me 24-7. I am having shit going through my head. I'm having being completely and totally numbed down. And the longer this goes on, the longer I am going to be mentally fucked to the point where I will not remember this. And this is the whole point. This is seriously fucking my brain to the point in hopes that I do not do this anymore. Or in hopes that I forget. I am having serious trouble thinking even doing this. I'm having trouble doing this. I'm having trouble thinking. I'm having trouble talking. Remembering. Congratulations to you. After three years, you delusional motherfucker. William Aldridge, you were guilty of murdering a bloodline. Blair Hardy, you were guilty of murdering a bloodline. Luckily, you are untouchable because you own OPP and you have sex with them. And that is the only reason. And they know that you can implicate everybody involved, including them. So you are untouchable and you know it. You own OPP and Napanee. You basically got them by the balls, the same ones that you suck on, Wooldridge and Blair Hardy. Chris Wood here. If you like this content, please hit the like button, share, and subscribe. It's very serious and very important. And I'm not doing these videos. It's not about hate. 
This is not any kind of conspiracy. This is not mental illness. It's not drugs. It is a crime on me, and it's being done through, like I said, remote neuro monitoring from the OPP to frame me and to basically murder me as William Aldridge as they collect insurance frauds on their victims. This is about stealing pensions. This is about stealing lives, collecting insurance policies on their victims, and then having them murdered. So, William Aldridge, you are one delusional, highly fucking piece of shit. Go see this, I can barely think. You did it, OPP. The whole point of this is to use this piece of shit to turn me into a vegetable like you. So I will suck your fucking dick so I'll be an easier human trafficking victim. I will be disappearing soon as William Aldridge or Blair Hardy, one of OPP's bosses or co-offenders that they are using with and for them. And I will not be proven wrong, said without paranoia. Chris Wood, love all, hate none. Hit that like button, share, subscribe. This is how OPP traffic, this is how OPP crave, and this is how OPP murder, and this is how they're getting away with it. Watch yourselves, watch your children and your parents. They murder parents, they have sex with children, and they sell them, along with adults too, to pedophiles and sex offenders. And they're making a lot of money. They make their money here through drugs, trafficking, and other crimes and murders. That's how OPP get paid in Napanee.